welcome mates, I'm Bloodthirsty Lord by Incoming Lordy, and today we're playing some Scrap Mechanic. This is episode 4, and I'm going to teach you how to do something amazing. We've got a, not an ordinary pole here. If we put this down a little bit, you get to see the amazing piece, which is a rocket ship. They didn't want us to build a rocket ship, but we did, boys. Look at the thrusters. You got one, you got another one, you got two, uh, three, four, another one, another one. Look how many there are. There is so many thrusters. It's pretty cool. I want to show you how this rock ship works. So, like, FPS just dropped like crazy just then. Because you're going to expect me to have that many thrusters and this other stuff all around here. But we're going to test this out. If we go inside the actual place, we open our doors. Opens like that. We jump in and hold our wrench out. The doors should close right after us in a couple of seconds. There we go. They close. Then we have our fuse box, we have some other stuff, controllers, which pretty much are controlling the doors and the objects. We got a button to play, listen to music, let's listen to it. Oh, that chillaxing music, boys. You'll love that. <laughs> Stop that. And then we got another button here. And you might be thinking, what is that used for? You will see, boys. But we can see little gaps there. We got like a little window. See through. We got some nuts. And every time we have a radio, we have to little. We have to have a little ducky close by since he will keep us calm when we're in a bad scenario. He's like a little buddy that we have when we travel. And if if I was, if I was to look at this like this, I bet you'll think it's the ground floor, like the floor I'm on. Haha! <laughs> Full of objects. Get it? Because I'm going to space, boys. Gravity's a bitch. Let's test this out. I haven't personally tested this. I know if hovers, but then I stopped it because I was too scared. But we're gonna try it out. So we're gonna press the button. The button of death, maybe, or the button of success. We shall see. So let's press it. Okay, boys, it's going up. It's going up. We're getting a little jumpy for some reason. Getting a little jumpy. No, no. Turn it off. Turn it off. Okay. How high are we? Oh, 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 no. No boys, no boys! Oh, no falling damage. You gotta love that. You gotta love that feature in creative mode. Oh boys, if we if we if there was falling damage, we'd been 100 dead. But that's pretty cool. We got pretty high with that. That was pretty good for the first try. I'm gonna put this up a bit so we can take away the lift. And then we're gonna teach you how to build this. It's I'm not gonna say it's hard. It's like a medium difficulty. You wanna have thrusters all at the bottom connected to one button, obviously. Or you can have like multiple buttons so you can control which way the uh, rocket ship turns. So I'll put it all to one button so I get that amazing power just going up, uh, upward and forward. But you can do other stuff if you want to. And our door has a bearing, two bearings at the bottom which connect to the controller on top. And then it connects to this switch. And the controller features are like that. So then once I open it. It will open it, and then after a couple of seconds, it will close, and it's at its slower... Um, oh, no, it's at a fast pace. It's at a fast pace as well, so when it reaches its last command on the controller, or the second last, the doors will close, so then I can activate my sh rocket ship and go to space, boys. But once we enter the rocket ship, the button here is not just for fancy looks. It actually cl um, controls another door. Since you know how this one does close, once that closes, we need to use another door. So we use this door to get out. And there we go. And then there should be another command for that door to close very soon. Hoping. I am hoping. Yeah, there we go. There we go. So it looks pretty cool. It looks like it came out straight out of Doctor Who. Which looks pretty amazing. I feel like the FPS has dropped so much due to the, all the other um, creations I've made that are close by. I might have to start deleting some stuff, but I'll make a new world one or the other. And this actually looks pretty good. Um, if you want to build one of these, you can. It's not that hard. So you can be able to have fun like me. We're going to test this one more time and reach the maximum amount. We're going to try that. We're going to wait for our doors to close before we start jamming to our music. If it's still on. Oh, I don't want to push. No, we're not going to push the button. We're just going to enjoy the view by looking at it from the bottom of this window. Because we can't open the door. Because that could be straight death. Okay, we're going to see. We're still we're jumping up. When you jump up, it's kind of bad since this will happen. Oh my god, boys. We're going to lose our rocket ship. No, 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 no. Look at high's gone. Oh my god. No, what the hell, boys? Where's it going? Where's it going? 
Oh, I, I can still see it through the ground. That is so cool. No, don't don't fly. Don't fly away. Don't fly away. We're coming for you, boy. We're coming to save you. We better hold out a lift. Oh no, sliding away. No, no, no. Come, come back, come back. Come my way, come my way. Come my way. Come on, no, no, no. Come, 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 come. Don't stay, 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 stay. That's good, that's good. Aren't you a good rocket ship? Woo. There we go. We saved the rocket ship. Lucky it didn't disappear someone else on the map, because then I don't know this map too well. So I think it, I would have got lost and lost my creation. Like, just having this as is, if it's not on the lift, becomes really laggy. See, look at the FPS now, it's beautiful. But when we release it off the lift, and it starts activating the doors and all the other features of this amazing rocket ship, it ends up going pretty bad with the FPS. But there should be features in the future that help with situations like this when you build something amazing. Yeah. So this is how you build a rocket ship. It, it's going to take some time. You want to have your thrusters pretty much equ equally spread out. So then the way you actually control it, it will go up straight instead of going sideways or anything. But if you want to make it go sideways, you make these side thrusters connected to a button. So once you activate, say, this button for these ones and another button for this, you'll be going towards the right side, depending on where you're standing in the rocket ship. But in other scenarios, you can do the exact same thing to go to the left side. This is a pretty cool rocket ship, I want to be honest. It was pretty easy, and I actually like the way it looks. We use metal blocks, we use the hazard um, material there. I think it's called hazard, I'm not sure what it's called. But it looks pretty cool. And then the top looks like a, um, a Doctor Who phone box. I'm going to be honest, that's what it looks like. From far, it looks like a Doctor, um, Doctor Who phone box from the top. Which is cool, I love Doctor Who. It's pretty sick, it's pretty sick. We're going to activate it without actually going inside it, and we're going to try to catch it. That's possible. Okay, it's going up, it's going up. Let's see how high it goes. Okay, okay, is there a, is there a sky barrier? Okay, is it going to come back? I don't think it's coming back. Okay, see you later. See you later. My rocket ship's going. My little rocket ship to the sky, little Einstein. Oh, it's f come back. Okay, we got a problem. It looks like it's stuck up there. Um. Um. I don't think they put sky berries in this game. I do not think they put sky berries. Oh, God. Oh, no. What, what do we do, boys? What do we do? Wait, it's coming back down? It's coming back down. Let's catch it. I think it's coming. Wait. Yeah, it's coming back down. Let's catch it. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, come on, boys. We can do this. What? Okay, it's there. Okay, it's gonna go on the outer, uh, outer ring of the map, I think. Oh, it's coming down, boys. It's like an asteroid. Where'd it go? No, not that way! Why'd it go that way? Oh my god. No. We can't run that fast. We're just a little fat guy. We can't do it. We can do it. Come on, we have to do this. We have to achieve this and get back our rocket ship. That is the goal for this episode. Oh, come on. Come on. Where the fuck's it going? I've lost it. I can't actually see it anymore. Like, it's so bright, and that, um, the white clouds there are pretty much camouflaging it. Oh, no. Where'd it go? No. I think I see it. It's there. See that bright little thing there? It's going down. No, it's going back up. It's going down, it's going down. It hit the bottom, it hit the bottom, it hit the bottom. Okay, if it's stuck to something, that is good. If it's not stuck to something, we can die. And that is a fire alarm in my house. Oh, wow. Wow, it's actually ringing. Okay, now stop ringing. I better than ring another tw two more times, the fire alarm, but it doesn't matter. Let's see if we can do this. Uh, where'd it go? Please tell me it just got stuck on a tree or just stuck on the sand or something like that. Something easy, so I just pick it up and enjoy myself. Because your FPS drops so much when that just is going wild around the map, as you can see sometimes in this video. Uh, where'd it go? At least we're exploring the map a bit. It's a pretty cool map. The terrain looks amazing. And the colors are beautiful. But I want my beautiful rocket ship back. I think if we go over this hill, and we should be able to see it. That is my conclusion for this episode, most likely. If we can find this and just bring it back to base. 
Oh, yes, we found it, boys. Look at it in the distance. <sighs> Dreams come true, boys. And look where he got stuck. He's got stuck in the sand or the fence. One or the other. <sighs> Get away from these rocks. So annoying. Okay. This game is going to get released tomorrow, or in a couple of hours, which is going to be super exciting since they'll bring survival most likely very soon to this super early access or the early access of Scrap Mechanic. And if you guys haven't got this game yet, you can get this game on the Steam Store in a couple of more hours. And it's 100% worth a buy. It is so enjoyable, and you can build so many things in this game, like I've built within my couple of episodes. I'm hoping to bring more episodes if you guys keep enjoying them. So if you do enjoy them, show your support by smashing the bloody like button. So that really is appreciated. Let's check it back to bed. Oh wait, you're gonna put it somewhere. So then, it there we go. Put it back up. Take it away. There we go. Let's go back. Let's go back to. Oh, where's base? Okay, this is not easy, boys. I think I lost my base. We we didn't go the exact same direction we came from, which I 100% don't remember. So I'm just gonna go over that hill and hopefully. Um, Backtracking works like you're doing a hunting game. You backtrack to where your death was when you die by some noob that somehow had an AK 47 or something. But it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. We're gonna do this. We have to get back to our base and succeed at bringing back our rocket ship. The one thing you don't want to do, you know, how I took the rocket ship from down there. If you change the um, item in your hands, like if I went back to my wrench when I had my lift and the rocket ship with me. If I go back to my lift, there's no rocket ship. I have to go back to the exact same location I picked it up from. Which is going to be irritating, so I better be careful. Okay, um... Hmm... What do we do? Where do we go? Who knows? Scrap mechanics work together. Okay, we got... I don't know what that is. I know what I just said, but I'm just rambling. What is that? Is that a tank? It's a tank with a symbol. Looks like it's got farm bots in it, which is the evil creatures within this game. Okay, I think I think I know that rock. I think I know that rock. Boys, I know that rock. I swear to God, I know that rock. We're going back to base, boys. We're going to back. We're going back. I think we are. I think. I think we are, mates. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I don't know why, I don't think the map's that massive. I'm gonna be honest. I feel like it's like a medium map. But for some reason, I'm getting lost. And it's actually annoying me. I can't see any of my... I should be able to see like a massive building. Or something. Because I, that I built. <gasps> Is that, that's it there. I think that's it. Oh, lucky. If I kept going in that direction, I would have been got lost. But you know, we've done it, boys. Lucky I built like a massive ton of shit. That is hard, I'm like... 75% um, useless, but it actually works. We can use it as a landmark within this game to find stuff. And that's what we did, boys. That is what we did. So we go back. We're still holding the lift, so that is good. And we need to land our rocket ship here. And there we go. I'm going to put it up and take away the lift. Bang, boys. Okay, so maybe it's uneven. I don't like it. It has to be somewhere straight. If it's not straight, it ain't right. It ain't right. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm going to hold our wrench out. Let's give this a little look here. Okay, too far. Looks amazing. It looks amazing. I'm loving it. Hoping you guys loved it as well. For episode 5, I'm going to teach you guys how to build a mechanic mechanical staircase that looks something like this I haven't made it look stylish as hell but it's actually pretty useful because then you have to use less resources so if, when it comes to the survival aspect of the game it's gonna help out quite a lot so that is all for this episode 4 the rocket ship edition and it actually works properly you, you gotta expect that it's me bloodthirsty look boys <laughs> Mate, if you enjoyed this episode, show your support by smashing the play like button. Let's try to get 10 likes on this video. And if you guys want to see more Scrap Mechanic on this channel, all you have to do is share this with your friends and hit the subscribe button to become a mate today. And that is all for this video. Oh, time to go, but don't you worry. We're back very soon. Hang on to your ads, boys, because ain't seen nothing yet.